there might be times when you will need to get a record for a reference to put into Covidence that isn't in a database or Google Scholar or any of the previous ways that I described of getting records into Covidence. So a good example of that would be an article that's just on its journal website. Maybe I found this by looking through the references of another paper, wherever it was, you know, I don't have the record from OneSearch or PubMed, so I'm going to get it directly from the website. Whenever this happens, again, we're just trying to get an RIS file. And so you want to look for something on the article page that says download this reference, export this reference, something like that, and then check that it's creating an RIS file. So this Springer article, for example, the link that we want is actually all the way at the bottom of this page, way past the references. At the very bottom, they have this cite this article section. And when I click download citation, a box pops up and I can see that it is indeed a .ris file. So I would save this to my computer and then import it into Covidence. Every journal website should have a feature like this somewhere. You just might have to hunt around for it. Uh, and you just want to double check that it's definitely an RIS file. If not, um, get in touch with us and we will see how we can get that article into confidence for you.